Hello. In this tutorial, I'll show you how to upload HD video to YouTube using free software available online for the PC. Most of the same principles should also apply to Mac, though not all of the software I'm using in this tutorial is available for Mac. The three pieces of software that I'm going to use in this tutorial are Virtual Dub, MPEG Stream Clip, and QuickTime. And you probably already have QuickTime. I've included download links for these programs in the video description. So here we have Virtual Dub and MPEG Stream Clip and a video clip that I prepared to be uploaded. So I load that into Virtual Dub. Then I go to Video, Filters, and I click Add Filter. And from there we click Brightness, Contrast, Gamma because we want to raise the gamma. And this will brighten the image, which we need to do because YouTube tends to darken it slightly. And I click OK. And then we also need to resize the video to format it for HD on YouTube. So to do that, resize, and we want to change the width to 1280, and just let the rest of it calculate. And then we want to letterbox it to 1280 by 720. Now that creates black bars around the sides to keep the proportions of the image correct. And if your image is actually not as wide as the 16:9 ratio of YouTube video, then you'll want to set the height rather than the width of the video resolution to make a height of 720 pixels. So once you've done that, go to File, Save as AVI, and choose a file name and location. You'll want to specify a new name so that it doesn't save over your old video footage. And then you should begin rendering. And rendering takes a little bit of time to process all the video footage. So make sure that you uncheck show input video and show output video as this will speed it up somewhat. So skipping ahead once the video is finished rendering, you can get out of virtual dub. You'll have your new video. And you want to open that in MPEG stream clip. And once you're in MPEG Stream Clip, go to File, and click on Export to QuickTime. And from there, we have a number of options. You want to set the compression to H.264. You can try other compressors, but that's what I use. And I find that quality around 85% is about as good as you need. It doesn't make much difference after that. And then set your sound compression to MP4. Now the frame rate, you'll need to adjust depending on the frame rate of your original video. My video was originally 15 frames per second, so to compensate for this I had to change it to 30 frames per second, which doubles each of the frames, because YouTube's HD video has to be at least 24 frames per second. And then once these settings are set, all you have to do is click OK and you should be good. And now you can upload your video to YouTube. Now the video should probably only take a few minutes to become live, but the HD version of the video may take several hours before it comes online. That's because the HD version of the video takes longer to process, so don't think that there's a problem when it doesn't show up right away.